I'm Jackie Vincent, and you're watching Who's That Lady Music Show. And welcome to Who's That Lady Music Show. And once again, we bring you the best of indies, rock, pop, soul, dance, and rap. And today we are delighted to have with us Jackie Vincent. So stick around for an amazing interview and live performance. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
With our special guests, welcome to the show. Now, before we dive into some Q&A, please introduce yourself. Oh. <laughs> My name is Jackie Vincent. I'm from Austin, Texas, and I'm so happy to be here in Brooklyn. Welcome to Brooklyn, <laughs> all the way straight from Austin, Texas. Yep. And let's start <laughs> with the first question. Right. You started out um, in classical music and decided to make the switch to contemporary music. Um, explain to our audience what made you decide to make the switch from that to contemporary. Very long story short, I was bored. <laughs> <laughs> I had played the piano for 13 years, mm -hmm. and it was just so lonely, the style I chose. It was classical piano, and it's just a very alone thing. You don't play right. really with a band. You might play with an orchestra, but even then you're pretty much still a solo artist. And um, it was just so lonely and, and my dad plays bass and he sings and he did that all all while I was growing up and people were always dancing to his music and coming up to him and telling him how telling him how much they love him and love his music and they're like, ah oh, and he, he just built this whole community around oh. his music. And like here I am alone in the kitchen like practicing Mozart. <laughs> and that just kinda kinda rubbed off on me after yeah. a while. I'm a people person. You know, for people who like to be alone, it's perfect. But mm -hmm. Uh -huh. I I'm kind of a people person, so yeah, you I look like a people people person myself. So yeah, yeah so so I decided an electric guitar would give me access to much more you know celebrated styles of music, at least in modern society. You ever thought about <laughs> incorporating classical with with your sound? I have. Uh -huh. You know, I watched Crossroads, uh -huh. and I watched that guitar battle scene, and he like beat out the devil, you know, yeah. playing Bach on the uh, on the guitar. So I've been thinking about it. But mm -hmm. I've just been having so much fun with the blues. <laughs> so I'll get there when I get there, you know, if I get there, whatever. All right. <laughs> All right. So tell me a little bit more about your creative process behind your latest EP, The Transcends. Transcends EP. So, yeah. so it started off, it was going to be a full length album, 12 songs. Mm -hmm. And I, the whole concept was that I wanted every song to be one word titles. That oh, was wow. That was what I started off with because I like to just be able to launch into something. I don't want to get caught up in like, oh, I should do this or oh, I should do that. So I get one idea and I just launch into it. Mm. So I start writing all these songs and all of a sudden I have 12 songs and five of them seem to have this common theme 
and the other eight of them, or, or the other, I guess it was 13 songs, mm. the other eight of them seemed to have another common theme. Mm-hmm. And I was like, well, hell, this seems like two separate projects now. You know? Uh-huh. So I took the five songs, and the theme of those five songs were like self-acceptance and strength and love nice. and acceptance of others. Five songs, they all just seemed to have that theme. Mm-hmm. So... I put that on the Transcends EP. Nice, nice. Yeah. So the other songs you're going to save for later. Oh, and yeah, that's coming out March work. 2019. All right, that's we're going to look for that. We're going to definitely look for that. Yes. Now, bring segue onto your production work. I have I read that you work with Michael Ramos, who's yeah. um, prominently known for working with John Mellencamp yep. and Paul Simon. And also you work with Boo Mitchell, yeah. who worked with... Um, Bruno Mars. Yeah, with yeah. Bruno Mars and uh, Mark Ranson and all yeah, those yeah. guys. You got some heavy hitters. So what it's like working with them? It's just really cool. They they obviously are talented in their own right. And they obviously have worked really hard in the industry to get the opportunities that they had working with all those really great people. Nice. And so it was really great to work with them because I got to draw from their experience. You know, they I learned a lot from from them. And you learn a lot as far as production sound and how to yeah. get the sound that you wanted. You oh know, yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I've been it's they just they've helped me develop further into who I yeah. am continuing to be. That's wonderful. <laughs> you know? That is yeah. wonderful. Now, what, as a singer, songwriter, and musician, what in- inspires you the most? Life. Just life experiences. Mm-hmm. Living life. Waking up every day. Because, like, people are like, life is short. All right. But yeah. it is and it isn't. You know? Mm-hmm. Like, uh-huh. Uh-huh. Sometimes, sometimes the days drag on. Sometimes you're like, oh my gosh, it's only six o'clock. <laughs> you know what I mean? And then it was like, oh wow, where the time yeah, goes? Yeah, or sometimes yeah. you're like, oh my God, it's been two weeks and I can't even, it felt like it was yesterday. So it's like, life is short, but also life is long. The day by day is really intense. Mm-hmm. You know, what are you going to go through tomorrow? What mm-hmm. are you going to go through the day after that? You never right. know what's going to happen. And that's what inspires me. Now, as far as going through, um, imagine that your live shows, what are the craziest things you've seen so far being, being, being on the road? I saw some chick get like lifted up cheerleader style uh-huh. and she just like dropped trow like in midair. She was just like <laughs> skirt gone, shirt gone. And all of a sudden like I'm playing a gig and this girl's on the dance floor like totally naked like in a cheerleader oh pose. Oh my god. Oh my She's god. She's like Where was this? Was this in the US or overseas somewhere? It's in Austin. Oh my god. <laughs> I was like what is happening? I think I was singing Thriller at the time. Oh. I was like, and this is Thriller. What is going on? Thriller. It was, so, it was pretty weird. That was the weirdest thing that's happened to me recently. No, <laughs> but I have stories for days. That is crazy. That is crazy. <laughs> now, has she influenced your, your music? Which takes, takes way to my I, next question. I do what? have a song called Naked Cheerleader. <laughs> it's currently, I'm writing it right now. And... Uh, it's in process. What are your other musical influences? <laughs> oh, gosh. Anybody who's great. Honestly, it's like, I know that's a really vague answer, but no, yeah. I, I love so much music. Like, literally anything from Stevie Wonder mm. to Rock Rachmaninoff to Chopin to Janelle Monet to Kendrick Lamar. Oh, my God. To Nora Jones to Joan Armitrading. That sounds like my record collection. I'm just saying, like... <laughs> literally anything that's really great and especially stuff that's really unique yeah so that's why i can't be like oh i'm really influenced by blues artists yes yeah i'm influenced by blue blues artists who are really unique mm-hmm. now so. describe your sound oh in one word one word uh rock just if, rock. if i'm gonna if i'm gonna have to belong to a genre mm-hmm. i think that i play so much rock that I would be okay with being called a rock artist. And rock is also a really broad definition. You know, like I don't like I don't like being called blues because blues is very specific. Yeah. Like a blues band is a blues band and they play blues songs and that's it. But like I can't be called a blues band because sometimes I play reggae. Right. You know, Mm -hmm. and sometimes I play pop, straight up pop. Mm -hmm. And sometimes I play like rock for like the entire set, depending on the set. You know, if it's a really high energy set, I'll pull out all my rock songs. So Rock can include reggae. Rock can include blues. Rock can include pop. And that's a solid foundation. Yeah. And my last question to you, where can Music Lover find you online as well as are there any shows? This is your time to just plug away. Plug away? Yes. (laughs) Well, I don't, I 
sorry, you might have to edit this out. I don't know when this is going to air. <laughs> so like, We want to air this in July. In July. Okay. Yes. <laughs> okay. So, edit. <laughs> you can find me at JackieVincent.com. It's Vincent with a V, not not a not a B. Yes. <laughs> yes. V-E-N-S-O-N. Yes. JackieVincent.com. And, and, you know, it's funny. I have, I have strife with my name. People never know how to spell it. But the good thing is that nobody spells it the way I spell it. So as a result, I have twitter.com slash Jackie Vincent. I have Facebook slash Jackie Vincent. I have YouTube slash Jackie Vincent. I got all the Jackie Vincents. And we're so. going to have your website and all that wonderful inf- information right below. So yes, you know, and totally. just plug it away. and You know, just type my name into Google and try not to find me. That is true. true. <laughs> challenge. challenge. A challenge for this episode. Yes. Challenge. <laughs> Thank you so much. So stick around, my friend. There you have it. Here to Sister Rock, and we're going to be rolling.
washes away my last time. My eyes are wide open, all I see is one man. He better act fast now and catch me while he still can.
So I'm gonna do a bridge of this or something. shine so bright they blinded me and now i see what i must do share my love till i am through oh oh yeah, yeah. share my love Takes every little ounce of patience. I've worked so hard to make this. Focusing to the tears in my eyes. Gotta work, gotta change my life. I wanna see I, I wanna grow further. Open my eyes and fight the good fight. Goodbye. I wanna die deeper. I wanna love truer. Open my eyes and fight.
cause a chain reaction Free ourselves from mental slavery Never falling for false security I wanna see I I wanna grow further Open my eyes and fight the good fight Good fight I wanna die deeper I wanna love to her Open my eyes and fight the good fight Living a 
house on the side of the street Where the grass is dead but they water the concrete In the summer I watch the people float by In the winter I watch them weep and cry I live in a little house on the side of the street Live in a little house on the side of the road Where the people starve just to feed their cars and boats In the fall the men they stop and shout In the spring the women frog about I live in a little house on the side of the road <laughs> Oh, try to believe That word will set you free Only wise men see that we were Why the grass is always greener on the other side In the day they go to work and wait In the night they drink their fears away I live in a place where the people wonder why Oh, try to believe That work will set you free Only wise men see Lady Music Show crew would like to thank Jackie Vincent for stopping by and we want to thank you the viewers for watching. See you next time. Peace.